Growing up in the 70s, we loved buying toys, cool toys like these. But sometimes we didn't have enough money for that. Or we were at some store that just sold cheap crap. So we had to buy rack toys like this and that. Let's take a look at rack toys. Rack toys. I've told you about rack toys before. We looked at some really crazy ones from TV shows to movies to just weird generic stuff. And I figured we haven't looked at rack toys in a long time. I know it sounds like I said rack toys, but we're talking rack toys. These are toys usually sold maybe at a gas station or maybe some little cheap store. They were usually on a spinning rack. That's why they refer to them as rack toys. Um, they usually have some license, like based on comic books and movies and stuff, but it's just a generic toy inside. You might see the same toy in a Star Trek package, a Popeye package, all kinds of packages, the same toy, just rebranded. So let's look at some rack toys. And we'll start right here with Super Specs, big old glasses, so you can look like this. Okay, that doesn't really look like spec glasses. Sorry, it's the best one I could find. But these are really cool. I, I don't really know... Super, I don't know they had made you super. I really don't know why you wear these. They're not like they're trying to make you look cool or anything. I don't know who would buy these. How about this one right here? <sighs> Your own print shop. That's right. You want something printed? Well, you need to print it with a stamp. Stamps were really big and rack toys. You put them in the ink and you get in trouble. Let's be honest. You had this, you're going to get in trouble because you're going to say you're not going to, but you're going to put that ink everywhere. The ink's going to end up on your bed, on your wall, on your sister's eyebrow. It's going to be all over the place. Trust me. Trust me. If you had a time machine, go back in time and don't buy this. Don't buy this. How about this one right here for the ladies, I guess, here? Pot and pans. Oh, getting them ladies started early. Get them started early to know. Hey, you stay in the kitchen. And there's some mini pot and pans. I'll see, I think I see a ladle. I think I see a ladle back there and a spatula so you can flip some eggs or something. Spatula. I don't know why the lady in the picture, she thinks she's got a dead cat on her head. I don't, I don't know what the deal with that is. How about this one right here? Chips. Chips did a lot of rack toys, but here we go. It's a police car. I know when you think chips, you think, oh man, a police car, a police van. No. Don't. You think motorcycles. <laughs> But here we go, chips. Mm, here's some more chips. Hey, you need some sunglasses? Well, here's a whole bunch of sunglasses for you. Now, I know, before you tell me in the comments, this is something they would sell at the store where a kid would take one out. They wouldn't buy all these in one pack. Believe me, that would be crazy. You would just buy one at a time. And so you can have that cool cop glass look, you know. That's why I had mirror glasses. I always wanted mirror sunglasses in the 80s. When I was got more of a teenager, so I was like, man, that's cool. I see cops wearing them. That's not cool. How about a Hulk with a, some mini soldiers and a tank? This looks actually pretty fun. Kill him. Kill him. This can't be real. This I think I just got I think I just got some shenanigans pulled on me. I, I, I saw, look at that. Let's zoom in on that. Whoa, you see that Hulk? I, I think I just got, I don't see no name brand. I'm sorry, but I think I got conned on that one. How about this one right here? You can be a cowboy with a cap gun, a holster, and I don't know, it looks like a whip, but I guess it's not a whip. You can be just like your dad, a cowboy. No, your dad wasn't a cowboy. Your dad wanted to be a cowboy. Now you can be, because, you know, when we were growing up, most of our parents wanted to be cowboys. You know, we were big in sci-fi and stuff, and they were big in the cowboys. Cowboys was the MCU of their day. And how about this one right here? Secret Wars. You don't, why hadn't there been a Secret Wars movie? Come on, guys. Here we go, Secret Wars Pinball. This is another one that was a little pinball game that was, you know, probably released on a different names, different cardboard inside. He would just shoot the little pinball up and it'd fall. It wasn't too much fun. But we didn't have iPads and cool stuff to play with in the car when we went on road trips. So we got something like this. And it has action flippers. I like that. I need to put that on a shirt. Just action flippers. I think I'll do that. I like that. Y'all like that? Let me know in the comments. Action flippers. That should be my nickname. Ah, uh, what about Japan? Or some other country? I think it's Japan. They even had rack toys. And of course, you know Japan. If they got a rack toy, it's going to be Godzilla related. These people love Godzilla. They love Godzilla as much as Americans love a hot dog. How about this one right here? Papa! Papa racing car. I don't remember Papa ever having a car, but there he is eating spinach in it, and getting chased by that guy that wanted to rape his girlfriend. And you get a little trophy along with it. And that's a nice touch right there, a trophy. How about this one right here? Spider-Man. Spider-Man was a favorite when the rack toys came. And what is this? Space rocket with re-entry shoot. <laughs> I had a re-entry shoot one time. 
We won't talk about that, but that's why I got two kids and not one. Let's move on to another here. How about this one? A Spider-Man. Oh, this, oh, it's like a helicopter thing. It's like a propeller. You just pull the string and rip it. And a lot of these. People had all these. These were cool. A lot of fun. A lot of action right there. How about a Hulk water gun? That's right. Power squirter. I know a girl that was a power squirter, but that's that's for a whole different video. But here it is, and it says Hulk right on it. Hulk power squirter. Hulk don't need no gun. Here we go. King Kong. At first, I thought this was a turd. I was like, they sold King Kong turd as a water gun? But it's King Kong's head. I see it now, but let's be honest. When you first look at it, it looks like a King Kong turd. Let's be honest here. How about this one? Spider-Man's back again, and this time he's got a little helicopter to fly in. Ain't it cute? I would like to have this one. If you're a Spider-Man fan, I think you would like to have this one too. Spider-copter. Oh, and it has function of, it says it's power. You can, it's actually powered. Maybe you can actually, maybe it's like a drone. I doubt it, I doubt it. How about this one? Star Trek Zigwing, which we know as a Frisbee, but Frisbee is a copyrighted term. You can't say Frisbee, so a Zigwing. I know, uh, what an odd name, but here it is, Star Trek, and look at them on there, look, they're kind of drunk. And we got another Star Trek, one of these uh, pinball games where you have to, I think this is the ones you have to shoot and get a high score, kind of like a skeet ball on the go. There it is right there, I see James T. Kirk, and I see Spock in there, and it's a lot of cool looking pictures, a real skill game. You can really show your skills with this one. And let's look at one more, Starfleet, that's the sound, sound like Star Trek. Walkie talkie with click action. Let's be honest, it's just a piece of crap. It's not really a walkie talkie, it's a piece of plastic. It don't even do anything. It's not, it's not, it's not even like one of those cheap walkie talkies that, that suck. These are just, I don't know if this can't be fun. This is, if you stand in the same room, you wouldn't use a walkie talkie. And if you leave different rooms, if you're like, hey, I'll be at the top of the house, you be at the bottom of the house, you're not gonna be able to hear each other and act to play with a walkie talkie. I don't understand how this could be fun for anybody. But there it is, Rack Toys. You're saying, Junkman, why are you talking so fast? Why is this video so short? Well, that's because it's 7.30 and I gotta get this up by eight o'clock. So let me get to it and get it up. And I wanna thank you for watching. Let me know some Rack Toys you had. Hey, Junkman <laughs> channel popping though. Thank you, sir, for that unsolicited testimony.